Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Maya Ryan here again. Um, today I wanted to show you um, a flipbook I made for a swap with um, Renee from One a Scrap. She hasn't received this yet because I still have it here. And I'm not going to upload it until she has it. It's as you can see a little bulky because I went a little overboard and I used my whoa what was it four and a half no three I think three inches by six for this and uh, we agreed on doing a swap she was gonna make a shabby chic flip flip book for me uh. and uh, I was going to make a doodle bug flip book for her. So I still had a lot of uh, cream and sugar left from uh, doodle bug. So I used that. I have no idea how I'm going to close this up. Maybe with uh, some ribbon. Because <laughs> it is very bulky. Anyways, um, this is the first page. I added some wink of Stella on the border strip. I don't know if you can see. I'm trying to make it shimmer but it doesn't really work. I cut a doily in half. I used my die for the hello, hearts, bling and um, liquid pearls. And here we go to the first page where I made a pocket by cutting a uh, Project Life card on a size that I could use. I did this Hey Cutie and there's Wink on, of Stella on that too. I added some uh, cutouts that I put in here so I made kind of a pocket. Then here we uh, we have our first flip. The second half of the doily. You're so sweet. It says here. I think you can see the shimmer a little bit. I actually did that on everything. I used it on this donut. Or yeah, that's a. I don't know what that is. This is a donut. I love these cuties with their smiley faces. And I uh, used donut washi too. And uh, here I made a pocket. And I made my first ever shaker mason jar. It's not perfect. Doesn't shake a lot, as you can hear. But it's a start. And I made some. Oh gosh. A little hard to get out. Hmm. I made some donuts for her and I put some more cutouts in here and um, this little envelope is from made of vellum. And I put some coffee beans in there. Here uh, I don't even know what I put in here because I finished this a while ago might be a letter in there. Haha. <laughs> Probably a letter. Oh boy. How did I do this? There we go. Oh no. I made some more coffee cup embellishments. Oh, help. Can't get them out. Like these. Aren't they cute? I think so. Some bling on the middle. So that's what it's in here. And I'll close that thing up later. Um, so, I'll do that later. Then you can flap this open. A cup of love. 
donut where you'd be happy. And I put another donut up here. And there is a die cut of a latte, ice latte on there. All came into this and odds and ends uh, package. So we go a little further. And hello, sweet cake. And I put this on there. More bling bling. And here I, uh, oh no, that's just a, this flaps up, flips up, flap, flip. Well, it's early. No, it's not early. It's 9 30, but uh, still. I don't think I'm quite awake. That's why I have my cup of coffee here. Isn't that? Look at that cup. Coffee, cappuccino, latte, yum yum. Um, yeah, my paperclip embellishments. And some more cutouts and some uh, liquid pearls, Wink of Stella, and here I did the tea. These are uh, small little bling pop, pop thingies, and everything is covered in Wink of Stella, or it has its own shimmer, a paper rosette, and the Hershey Kisses. So... Now we're going to go to the end. Another doily. Love you a latte. I love Renee. She is a sweet friend. And she actually uh, lives in Ontario too. Not that close to me. It's about a six hour drive. Unfortunately. Because otherwise we could have had some great crafting moments. And then we go... Well, let's put this all right. You back and you go down. And there. This is really a flip book because it flips in every way that you can imagine. Here I made some more coffee cups. And I liked to put this on a piece of washi coffee. And on the back I did hugs and kisses. So I hope she's going to like it. It is not... I, I should have had this different. Like, I should have had gussets here and on that side. But um, I'm still trying to figure out what, what way of making a flipbook is best for me. I have some more things in mind, so I hope she forgives me and that she likes this. And, uh, well... That's the flip book I made for Renee, and we'll see. Uh, I'm not sure I'm going to mail this out when she has mine finished. Because, well, it's summer, and uh, we don't spend a lot of time in our craft rooms. At least I don't, because it's either too warm here, or I uh, am at work, unfortunately, because I would rather be crafting. Anyways, um... Thanks for watching, and you all have a wonderful day. Bye.